Now you already know that conjunctions link two clauses together. There are different types of conjunctions. One of the types of conjunctions are the coordinating conjunctions and they're our fanboys. There are seven of them and using the correct conjunction is really important. Today I'm going to show you an example from one of my favorite movies of all time. It's called The Emperor's New Groove. Now it is really important to use the correct conjunction because otherwise it can change the meaning of your sentence. I'm going to give you an example. There is no handle in here. There's not? Are you sure? All right. I've had enough of this. Tell us where the talking llama is and we'll burn your house to the ground. Uh, don't you mean or? <sighs> Tell us where the talking llama is or we'll burn your house to the ground. Well, which is it? That seems like a pretty crucial conjunction. <sighs> That's it, Crank. Break the door down. So in case you haven't seen the movie, the bad person in this movie's name is Yizma. Now Yizma says... Tell us where the talking llama is and I'll burn your house to the ground. So when she said and, she's demanded that someone tells her where the talking llama is and they're going to burn their house to the ground. Why would you want to tell her where the talking llama is? Because then your house is going to get burnt to the ground. Oh, Yizma, I wouldn't want this to happen at all. Both of those options are very, very bad. I would be very, very sad if I told you where the llama was and you burned my house to the ground. However, if we changed that conjunction to or instead of and, it then changes it to give us two options. We can either tell them and keep our home or we can burn our house to the ground. So it changes it from being two bad options to one happy option and one not so great option. That is why it is a crucial conjunction. So conjunctions change the meaning of a sentence. So in the sentence, I really wanted ice cream for dessert. Mm, I didn't want vanilla flavor. I can use and and but, but I can't use or or for or nor. What about this one? I wasn't feeling well. Mm, I didn't go to school. Well, I can use and and the best one to use would be so, but I can't really use but and or doesn't make sense. I wasn't feeling well or I didn't go to school. I would say but if I had gone to school anyway. Now it's your turn to have a go at some conjunctions. 